Hey everyone, welcome to another edition of the Teen Corner. My name is Miss Rachel and I am the Teen Services Librarian here at Morley Library. So for today's Teen Book Talks, the theme is going to be centered around the immigration and refugee experience as told by authors who have actually experienced it firsthand in their own voices. The two books I'll be highlighting today are first one is Everything Sad is Untrue and this came out in August of last year, 2020, and this is by author Daniel Nairi. And the second one is actually coming out in just a few months, and this one is called Zara Hossein is Here, and this is by Sabina Khan. So, our first book Everything Sad is Untrue by Daniel Nairi is an autobiographical novel about Daniel who was born in Iran. His mother was a devout Muslim who converted to Christianity and joined the underground church in Iran, since it's actually pretty much forbidden to um, convert religions. As a result of converting to Christianity, she ran into conflict with the secret police and the family ended up having to escape they became refugees and eventually they settled and got asylum in Oklahoma. And this is how the book opens. With a young middle school age Daniel in class telling stories about what life was like in Iran. Met with skepticism from his classmates, however, he shares stories about how he was much better off in Iran. He talks about his family's beautiful history life in Iran, the music, and of course the delicious food. Storytelling, mythology, and legend collide with reality in this own voices book based on the true story of Daniel. If you're interested in experiencing the sights and sounds of another culture, the beauty of storytelling, and a first-hand look at the refugee experience, I definitely recommend you check out this book. And now on to our second book. Okay, so the second book, as I mentioned, that I'll be highlighting is from the debut author, actually, that brought us The Love and Lies of Roxana Ali, and that is Sabina Khan. Now, her new novel, Zara Hussein is Here, is set to be released in April, but you are welcome to put a hold on it in our catalog. If you want to give us a call at Morley Library, it is available to put a hold on and reserve it. Okay, so this book is about 17-year-old Zara, whose family moved to Corpus Christi, Texas from Pakistan when she was a baby. Um, being the only Muslim girl at her conservative Catholic school, she really struggled to fit in. And it didn't help that a fellow classmate by the name of Tyler Benson was determined to torment her. Now, one day, Tyler takes things a bit too far by defacing Zara's locker with a racist message, which actually gets him suspended. As an act of revenge, Tyler and his friends vandalize Zara's house with Islamophobic graffiti, which leads to a violent crime that puts Zara and her entire future at risk. Now, Zara must choose between fighting to stay in the only place that she's ever known as home or losing the life she loves and everyone in it. So in conclusion, both of these books would be excellent reads anytime, but especially now with the issue of immigration and refugees continuously being in the news. But these books and books like them give us something unique and that is first-hand accounts of what it means to be an immigrant in America today. So that concludes today's book talks. As always, if you're interested in either of these books, please give us a call at Morley Library and we'll be happy to put them on hold for you. Thank you again for watching and happy reading.